not often that bars are passed down through multiple generations of families, but for one Menominee staple, family is all they know, which makes saying goodbye even harder. But its owner says sometimes you just need a change of pace. If you've been to Menominee at all in over the past, say, 93 years, you've probably stopped for a beer or two at Dean and Sue's. And then this is me and my mom and my daughter. What started out as a grocery store and three stool bar has transformed into a local hangout with a patio, sand volleyball court and dance hall. The glass is still, the glass is still there. It's boarded up. Yeah. Owner Mickey Rucklin took over the family business in 1977 from her parents, like, um, Dean and Sue, who got it from her grandparents. They wanted a business for, uh, for the brickyard and for the local people in the neighborhood. And uh, they were just hardworking people that, yeah, wanted to try to make it. Mickey That's has worked in the this. bar since she was 15. My mother was grew up up there and then so did I. But literally grew up in the apartment above it. So deciding to sell is very bittersweet. It's time. We want to get it out there. We're all older and it's just time to, to go on and hopefully someone with them lots of ambition and uh, can do great things with it. It's a long time to be here. Great family, I mean, friendly, kind, just good, good people. Mickey says she isn't selling because of the pandemic, just that her family is ready for the next chapter. And I just want to go to work in a daycare and take care of babies and little kids and yeah, and do something else because I have been doing this since I was 15. The bar, which is only closed three days per year, has helped the family create lifelong connections. Mickey says won't soon be forgotten. That's what I'm really going to miss is the people. So that's going to be the hardest part, but hopefully I'll see them. Probably get to spend more time with them. And as you heard, Mickey says she's hoping to work at a daycare once she sells the bar and as well as spending time with her grandson and all her loyal customers, but from the other side of the bar.